my dear student in this question you can just see that if two digit number is such that the product of a digit is 35 so first condition has been given that product of product of its digits has been given is 35 according to question and what is given in the second if 18 is added to the number and second condition of this question is if 18 is added to the number if 18 is added to the number the digits are interchange their place it means you have to just find find out reversing number and by the help of these two condition you need to solve this question my dear student let's start let the digit at the ones place i have just considered it as x and the digit at the tens place is equal to y and what is the required number actually required number is 10 y plus x you can just see that and number is obtained by interchanging its digit uh, is 10 x plus y because once comes at the tens place and tens digit comes at uh, once place after that according to question it has been given that the product of its digits and you can just see that x into y is equal to actually 35 and this is y x is equal to 35 upon y and it is considered as 1 again it has given in the question that again you can just see that if 18 is added to the number 18 is added to the number and number is uh, 10 y plus x in this question you have to add 18 then digits are reverse it means 10 x plus y you get and after that you have to just solve and get the uh, another equation and after that you have to put the value of x in that second event after that you need to solve this question and you can get y minus x is equal to minus 2 and uh, from first because the value of x uh, has been given 35 upon y so in place of x you can just put 35 upon y and uh, after that you can just solve the question actually this uh, equation has been converted as quadratic equation and uh, the equation you get y square plus 2y minus 35 is equal to 0 after that you need to factorize and after factorization you can get y plus 7 into y minus 5 is equal to 0 and to solve the uh, solve its value uh, you have to just write down y plus one condition is y plus uh, 7 is equal to 0 so y is equal to minus 7 but you know that digit cannot be negative so this value cannot be possible and second one is is that y minus 5 is equal to 0 y is equal to 5 and now you need to put the value of y in the first first equation and then you can just find out uh, by putting the value of y is equal to 5 x is equal to 35 upon 5 is equal to 7 you get and after that you can calculate the required number now putting the value of y in first and the equation first has been given x is equal to 35 upon 5 and this is why you get 7 and this is why so required number is equal to 57 actually this is the first method and now I am going to discuss its second method how can you calculate the same question but approach is different my dear student in the second method of, of this question you can just see that uh, this is also similar up to here let the digit at the ones place is x digit at the tens place is y the number required number is equal to 10 y plus x 
and the number obtained by interchanging its digit is equal to 10x plus y and after that you can just see the question from question it has been given that product of two numbers is equal to 35 and the second condition of this question has already been given that the number the two digit number when added by 18 then digits are re reversed that means 10x plus y and when you just solve the uh, simplify it then you what you get x minus y is equal to 2 and it is considered as uh, equation second after that you have to apply one formula or you can just say that algebraic identities x plus y whole square minus x minus y whole square is equal to 4x as 4xy this is uh, x plus y whole square minus x minus y whole square is equal to 4xy actually this is uh, algebraic identity and you have to apply and putting the value since we get uh, from second that x minus y is equal to 2 so in place of x minus y you have to put 2 and here you have to just mention from from second you may write plus y whole square minus 4 is equal to 140 and this is why x plus y whole square is equal to 140 plus minus change into plus plus 4 is equal to 144 and after that x plus y is equal to square root under 144 and its value will be 2l and this is considered as this is considered as third one and if you just solve second equation has been given x minus y is equal to 2 and third equation has been given x plus y is equal to 2l and when you have to just add x uh, second and third when you add second and third equation then you can get x is equal to 7 and after that putting the value of 7 either in uh, any one of them first second or third any any one of them uh, you can just put I have just putting the value in second and what I get y is equal to 5 when you get both x is equal to 7 and y is equal to 5 then you need to put uh, on two digit number 10 y plus x and finally uh, I get the value two digit number that is 57 and that is the solution and it is better in both the both the methods uh, it is better to use the second method because it is completely based on the uh, uh, the required the solution it is based on you i i i prefer i prefer second i prefer actually second method it is due to that second method is totally based on elimination methods whatever it need some arrangement of the questions this is why you try to solve by these methods